virgin fishing grounds on Australia's own doorstep provide the raw materials for a new national industry, salmon, overlooked for centuries as a large-scale source of food supply. Gulls join trawler men making up for lost time. Trailing sharks menace the nets. South of Eden, New South Wales, the same trawlers return from each trip, rich with Father Neptune's bounty. The silver harvest that's already marked for a role of increased importance in the Commonwealth's plan for self-sufficiency. Opened only a few months before, the Eden canneries now prepare a new delicacy for Australia's tables in less time than it takes the salt water to dry. Electricity quarters the time of scaling. Heads roll like Paris in the Reign of Terror. Till now, every tin of salmon was imported and dollar restrictions have made Australians look to their own larder. But lack of equipment still holds up full production and Australian canneries still have a long way to go before there's enough left over to export to Britain. All the year round canning is an industry with a future. Present output of 60,000 tins a month barely covers local needs, but already immigration figures are rocketing. Who wouldn't go down under just for a change from snook?